Ladies and gentlemen, Nef from Nef's Tech Bits, how's it going today? Ladies and gentlemen, monsters, trolls, demons, these things do exist. And here we have one, John Steele. That's right, John Steele from a Chicago lawyer house, whatever you want to call those, a facility. He was also married to a lawyer, is in jail for 14 years right now for the most incredible reason copyright trolling now this is a bit of copyright trolling at an angle that I've never really quite seen before it used to be what copyright trolling was is you make a thing we make a thing and then somebody who owns copyrights who has purchased copyrights sees that oh yes yes this thing it looks a lot like this copyright I purchased and it looks a lot like the description of this copyright that I had purchased. So you owe me money for your copyright. And I get to uh, indulge in that because I purchased this copyright that sounds like it's describing what you made. That's the standard definition of a copyright troll. But in this situation, Mr. Steele, he had an idea. Mr. Steele, he went into, um, well, he was still in studying to be a lawyer he decided that what he was going to do with a call from his friend his friend told him dude i got this great idea i got this great idea what we're gonna do is we're gonna buy porn we're gonna buy the rights to pornography and then what we're gonna do is we are going to put it online we're gonna put it on torrent sites and then when people download it we're gonna sue their asses off yeah that was the big idea. They would purchase or create pornography, put it on these uh, these web pages or these torrent sites, and then when you download them, they would nail you to the wall. Anyways, anyways, uh, pre Prenda? Prenda Law Troll Saga ends with prison of its founder. 14 years in prison for our boy John. Bought and created porn seeded it themselves, then sued people who downloaded it. The person that gave him this idea was Paul Hansmere. Going to jail now. 14 years on conspiracy of wire fraud. His buddy Hans... Hans? Sorry, Paul. Paul went to uh, jail for 14 years because of this. So oh, this is the stuff I love. Just mm, so good. So good. Not only that, but they have to pay back everything. Everything. They got to pay back everything that um, that they took from other people. Man, man, people like this make me wonder about, about humankind. Usually I get really angry at individuals who, who say things like, oh, we're destroying the world. We're the worst plague upon the universe we shouldn't have any children because we're such giant pieces of crud well maybe some of us are giant pieces of crud apparently he's being reformed apparently uh he's rolling over on his buddy so that he gets less time so yeah trolls exist people demons exist monsters exist but they're not the standard of what we think they are they're in our heads they're our neighbors sometimes, they are us. Some of the worst trolls might not necessarily be on 4chan or the dark places of the internet. They're across the road from you. They're in law offices. Just because you have money, you have a suit and tie, and you look kind of dashing. Look at that guy, he doesn't look too bad. I wish I got a color version of him. I could see this guy getting all kinds of punami from the ladies. But still, He's only going to get to be tossed in salad in jail. Jail in Pennsylvania. That's interesting. That's interesting. <sighs> but the Lord doesn't give us what we can't handle, right? Anyways, that's it for me. Something to celebrate. Nev from Nev's Tech Fits. Have a good one, folks. And take care of each other. Don't be frauding each other.